All right, so uh, in my drawing of circuits, um, the kids have had a health lesson. They know what's a good choice or a bad choice to eat. So they take uh, the ground and come in and say, oh, soda's a bad choice. When they hear that sound, of course, with the chocolate as well, means a no, bad choice. If they get to a good choice. Yum, eat me. Yum. Eat me. And so they are creating the circuit. The orange here is the ground. And so oh. using it to select yeah. um, then finishes the circuit. Okay, so I used my drawing here. And what the intent of this is, is to have the kids evaluate and reflect upon how they did in cooperative learning um, in their groups and working through some STEM problems. So the student would come up and they would get points for everything that they did. And it was kind of like an all or nothing type of thing. And then depending on their point range, because I'm using the scoreboard app, depending on the point range, they would get to put their name in a jar for, for a drawing at another time. We got it here on home. And did you use kind words when you, when you disagree? And if that person presses it, they get seven points. Did you do your job? Did you have to encourage someone to participate? No, so they don't touch it. Did you respect the materials you were using? Well, that's the WP I got. Um, that is uh, worth six points. So this person got 23 points out of 30. So they would go into the drawing. If you get 20 or 20 points or above, you get to put your name in the drawing. Right, so I made a safety poster for drills. We use a lot of different tools in my classroom. So I thought that this would be a great way for students to um, remember some of the rules. So this one is for the drill. And I have attached all of these, um, all of my alligator clips. And I have the ground up here. One of the things I, then it will say the phrases on the poster. Hold the drill securely with both hands in the manner you were shown. Secure your work to the workbench with a clamp or the vise. Tie back long hair so nothing gets caught in the moving parts. Protect your eyes by wearing safety glasses. Pump a lot of soap into your hands and swish it around. Turn on the water and wash your hands. Make sure to scrub. Don't your hands for 30 seconds. Hi, this is Celeste. Uh, for today's drawing activity, I decided to do a social emotional learning um, board. And so what kids would do is they would push the I feel, this is the earth, and then they would choose whichever color they are that represents their how they're feeling. Um, for each of the feelings or the colors, um, three of them I made my own sounds, and then one of them I chose to use the ones that were on the sampler. So this is what it sounds like. <laughs> so that's if they're feeling blue, which means they're either tired, sad, sick, or bored. And this is if they are feeling yellow, which is excited and hyper. Yeah! <laughs> and then if they're feeling calm um, or happy, ready to learn, this is what it would sound like. And then finally, if they're angry or in the red, this is what it would sound like. Ah! <laughs> and there we have it.